G'day guys, Ozzy for HD, and welcome back to another episode of Foot Champions to Glory on my channel. Now today you may notice my hair is a little bit better than what it was the other day. It's had some improvements made to it. You know, it's a little bit better than the old sort of Amazon style forest cut it was the other day. <laughs> First things first guys, I would like to thank you for the support you gave in yesterday's video. I asked for 11 likes, yeah, it was an odd number, I thought, you know, why not, see if we can hit it. We hit 24 likes within the first 24 hours. I would like to thank you guys for the support, it has been absolutely amazing. The amount of comments, the amount of supportive comments in the comment section down below was absolutely amazing. And I would like to thank you guys. You guys are the best fan base ever. We're only a small YouTuber you know, channel, but hopefully we can grow together as a community. I'm not gonna ask too much from you guys today, but let's see how many we can hit. I'm not gonna set a goal for you guys, but if you're there, you're watching the video, hit the like button to show your support. It would be much appreciated. So today, guys, we're gonna be jumping into the rewards from the weekend, and uh, if you didn't know already, we ended up getting Elite 2 for the week, so not the best, but you know, not the worst either. You know, I did start off the best I've ever started off. I had 10 games in the first, 10 wins, and I had, uh, sorry, uh, put that around the other way. <laughs> I had 10 wins in the first 10 games, and also, I had 10 wins in the last 10 games, which means I went 13 and seven in my remaining 20 games. In that middle 20 games, I went four losses in a row. That simply is just not good enough, lads. Anyway, I can't complain all day of how I went on the weekend. Elite 2 is still good, and I just wish one day I'd get into the top 100 area. However, hopefully that isn't for another weekend in, in another time. However, without me talking and you know too much, and without further ado, let's jump into the pats. So guys, as I said through the intro, you know, Elite 2 was our, uh, was our destination from this weekend. And you know, it could have been better, as I said in the intro, but it could have been worse. I mean, I know you guys sometimes struggle to get into gold one and sometimes elite three. Some of you even struggle to get into gold and I really do appreciate that I am, you know, gifted to play FIFA like I, you know, have been the last few months, you know, gifted the time so that I can get better at the game because, you know, I know some of you can't even play foot champions because you don't have enough time on the weekend or, you know, for different reasons here and there. But uh, yeah, I just really do appreciate, you know, my, my time that I get to play FIFA because, you know, um, it won't last forever, especially when I go into study in the next few uh, you know, few months, uh, which starts in July, I believe. So, you know, as hopefully I, you know, can still play FIFA every now and then and keep this channel running. But uh, yes, yeah, study will have to be first priority, as well as this FIFA channel. I'll see if I can get a few uploads every week up and for you guys to enjoy. But as you see, one 100k pack and one premium team of the week pack is the rewards for Elite One, as well as 100,000 coins. I'm not complaining. That's going to be really good, you know, coins to add to the total, uh, which will go towards team of the season cards and team the season packs for you guys to hopefully enjoy some of the squad builders and some of the pack openings that I will hopefully do in team of the season. As you see in our first 100k pack, we got the 84 rated Joe Hart from uh, Toronto. Tor Toronto? Toronto? Or is it... Oh, I'm, not even, I'm not even going to uh, attempt that. But as you see, we got Kanto, which isn't bad. And I thought to myself... Um, I should be smart with this, because Kante, the man of the match version, which is in my main team, is worth 500,000 coins. I just packed a first owner, Kante, which I do love my first owners. Uh, you know, so I thought, why not be smart smart with this? Why not uh, I just keep this Kante, sell the man of the match, and, uh, you know, pick up 500,000 coins, which can go towards a team of the season card, maybe even team of the season Kante if he gets one. So I decided, and I'm not sure if you see it in this video, but hopefully in a future video, to actually sell the man of the match Kante and keep that regular Kante for my main team to play on the weekend lead. So I will get, you know, an extra 500k, which will be amazing to go towards Team of the Season cards, as I said just before. And, uh, you know, the extra few th hundred thousand coins will be helpful for, this, you know, different squad builders and different players and bits and pieces here and there, especially fitness cards. It's, oh, geez, they've gone up in price. I think they're like 1,500 coins now, which is just out of this world. And it gets very annoying. Annoying, especially, you know, when you think EA can actually dump them on the market and could improve the problem with that. But as you see in our premium team of the week pack, we ended up getting absolute trash. And I was so 
so so disappointed with how I got um, you know just what I got in this pack in general it's just disgraceful I mean 84 rated Gomez he only goes for around oh, 15,000 coins which is just appalling and look at the other two I got I mean I actually looked at the team of the week and you'll see it in this video I go and look at the team of the week and what I got was literally the worst I could have got out of all of the team of the week players because there's only two 81 rated in forms or yeah, I think there's only two or three rated informs, 81 rated informs, and uh, I definitely got the worst out of the bunch, and that is just very disappointing to see. I maybe thought after opening that pack, maybe I could have held it on for the Nets weekend, uh, sorry, Nets team of the week, but then I thought, you know, I could have held on to that and got even worse. So I can't complain. I mean, it's an extra 50k, or not even that actually. It's only around 40k that I got from these players, which is still a disappointing. As you see, I discarded that last inform because after you know EA Tats, you wouldn't have made much more than the, than the discardable value anyway. So I just decided to uh, to discard him. As you see, I'm hitting you with supersonic speed at the moment. Just listing up all of the players. I mean, I got decent coinage. I think I ran. I got around. Um, it was around. Uh, 200k that I got from Elite One Rewards, which is probably the worst you could get, especially when you only get, you know, especially when you get 100,000 coins. Uh, to only get 100,000 coin, or I don't even think of that. I think I might have got, <coughs> excuse me, I think I might have got only. Yeah, it was around 180 to 200,000 coins in value. So, um, when when you think about it, you know, with three guaranteed informs and a 100k pack, you should expect a little bit more than just 80,000 coins from that pack, from those packs. But as you see, though, I'm going to look in the prices of uh, of the uh, men of the match Kante because I am I was at that point thinking about listing him up. And also, you see me check the price of Ronaldo because I mean Ronaldo is great this year. He's my favourite player. I need him in my squad, but I thought. What happens if I get to the stage where I can afford Team of the Season Ronaldo, but I couldn't afford him by the time Team of the Season comes along because I didn't sell him early? Because I believe he, uh, Ronaldo will go down in price in the next couple of weeks, heading towards Team of the Season, because people are trying to stack up their coins to buy pats, to buy players, etc. So I'm thinking maybe Ronaldo will go down in price, which gets me a little bit worried. So I am sort of thinking about selling Ronaldo in the Nets, you know, before the Nets weekend league. I'll play him this week weekend league, but I believe next weekend, or next week, sorry, I will sell him, because I think I need to get the coins in the bank, uh, you know, guaranteed, so that I can, you know, at least buy a decent team of the season card. Imagine team of the season Ebra. <sighs> I could think about getting team of the season Ebra. He would be absolutely amazing. As you see, though, I'm going to pick up De Gea. I had to sell De Gea uh, in the end to buy that team of the season, sorry, uh, that, uh, SBC David Luiz because he cost around a million coins. You know, you guys would know that. You know, a million coins is a lot of money, and I had to sell uh, De Gea to finish it off. And uh, basically, I just rebought him from the coins that I made from this weekend. So, you know, a decent team I've got here. You know, the SBC David Luiz, Pogba, Man of the Match Kante, Ronaldo, Man of the Match Walcott, and what a team we have available to us. And hopefully, as we move towards Team of the Season, it will be even better. But that'll be it for me, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Can we smash 10 lights? You hit 24, 24 or 25 lights yesterday. We absolutely smashed it. And I must thank you guys. The support lately has been absolutely amazing. And I'd like to thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm trying to swallow my spit here for liking, commenting, just turning up to the video in general. It is much appreciated. I hope you enjoy your day, guys. Have a good day, you know. And, yeah, peace.